Hey, this is Quint with Drums On Demand. <clears throat> I'm going to show you how to install our, our sample kits, uh, drum sample kits, into GarageBand. Um, first thing I'm going to do is go to Go in the Finder, Home, Library, Application Support, GarageBand. So you want to start with that on your left hand side. Okay, let me close this. Uh, on your right hand side, you'll just open up the folders uh, that containing the drums on demand sample instruments um, uh, after you've unzipped it. Uh, if you don't know how to do that, you could look at one of our other videos. Uh, anyways, and so what we've done is we've color coded the three folders or the, the three folders you have to be concerned about. So the first thing you want to do is open up instrument library and you'll see there's you open up sampler and you take the sample files, okay, Funk and Soul samples, and you just drag those uh, into this sampler files folder. As you can see, I've already installed Manic Metal, so I'm not going to drag it into that. I'll just drag it, Funk and Soul samples, into the sample folder, okay, and it copies those over. Then I open up the sampler instruments and you'll see this folder here, Sample Instruments, and you want to take the .exs files, and there's three of them in this case because we have three different snares. Sorry, okay, so I've got .exs, the Funk, Acrylite um, snare, the Brash snare, and the Piccolo snare. Those are the three different instruments, and I'm going to drag those into the Sample Instruments folder. Drag those over, and now I've got five kits because I've already had already installed this other. And then finally what you want to do is go into the uh, GarageBand folder. And let me go back here and it'll be in here software and I've created a folder called Drums On Demand. So the first time I installed this I actually dragged this folder Drums On Demand in and that contained the heavy metal files. Now I'm just going to drag over these three kits just into our Drums On Demand folder, which is already there. And now I've got those five software instruments in there. Those are the three parts, the actual samples, the instrument, and this is like the GarageBand file that goes along with it. And then I'll open up GarageBand. I'll click on the I here to show all the installed instruments. I see under Drum Kits is Drums On Demand. And if you click on that, you'll see the three funk kits I've installed as well as, as as well as the two Manic Metal that were already there. So if you click on it you'll notice it spins for a second and there we have them installed. <laughs>